Hey y'all, I'm pretty sure you already know what time it is, but it's haul time. Welcome to this year's back to school clothing haul. I'm literally so excited for all the clothes I have. Everything is so perfect and so cute. But without further ado, let's get into this year's 2023 back to school clothing haul. First, I'm gonna start off with Altered State this color y'all the first thing i got from altered state was this shirt i is still sticking out oops i never cut her off it's this super stretchy like waffle material the color is so pretty on it's so flattering and the way it just like hangs off my shoulders is just the cutest thing ever i actually wore this on the first day of school next thing i got from altered state was this t-shirt it's a really cool graphic tee i love the graphic on it i feel like it's super unique super oversized and it fits perfectly the perfect little oversized graphic tee and the color is super pretty. Next up is Forever 21. I haven't shopped there in forever, but <laughs> forever, right. I was searching on Google for cute graphic tees and Forever 21 popped up. So I was like, okay, let's go look. And tell me why your stuff is actually really cute. First thing I got was the super pretty Nirvana graphic tee. I'm obsessed with the color of it. I feel like it matches the color of my eyes. Like it's literally the color of my eyes. So I feel like it's very flattering. Next thing I got from Forever 21 was again, another graphic tee, it's like a skull on it. And it says, what does it say? This is the offspring dividing by zero. To be honest, I don't think I read it before I bought it. I just like the graphic. Anyways, the graphic has this like super cool skull on it and it has like flames. It's just again that perfect oversized fit that I feel like would be really cute. Then shocker, I got another graphic tee. I got this little gray baby tee. It says Woodstock on it. It's just super cute. I thought it'd be really good to throw on with like a pair of denim shorts and some Converse, just a simple little outfit. Then lastly, from River 21, I got this crew neck. This crew neck's my favorite thing I got from them, actually. Well, it's a Pink Floyd crew neck, and it has the faces of the Pink Floyd members. This sweatshirt reminds me of something I've seen on Urban, and it's such good quality. Next up is Amazon. I actually have three bags of things from Amazon. I'm gonna show what's in the small bag first. The first thing I got from Amazon, um, she's a little tangled up right now. How do I show this? Free People makes this really cute romper dress that I absolutely was in love with when I saw it. But then when I saw the price, I was like, don't, can't justify that for a dress. So instead, I found a dupe on Amazon. It's this super cute gray dress, and it has like built-in shorts, and these straps are adjustable. I'd like this to be fun for a day where I just want to dress up a little bit more. I also think it'd be great just to wear to church. Then here's the next Amazon bag. I got two things in this bag. Look at the colors of these. I'm so obsessed. I wanted the Lululemon Pace Rival skirt so badly, but that tennis skirt is like $60. I didn't want to spend $60 on a tennis skirt. So instead, I got the dupes from Amazon. I got this color and this color. I'm obsessed with these skirts. They're so cute. And I just feel like they're the perfect piece to wear to school. They have built-in shorts underneath so that I'm not like exposed at school. And then I'm also obsessed with this purple color. They have like little lines across the front and then they're pleated in the back, which is I think a really cute aspect. And I feel like they'd be great to pair with like an oversized t-shirt. Not for the big bag from Amazon. If you know me, like if you know me in person or even if you've just seen enough of my videos or pictures, you know that I wear the exact same pair of denim shorts like 24 seven. There are these light blue Levi shorts I'm obsessed with and they're actually from Amazon. I decided this year that I wanted to branch out from just wearing this pair of shorts. So I decided to order the same pair in multiple colors. First up, I got this blue pair. They're slightly distressed at the bottom and it's more of a deeper blue wash, but it's not quite like a dark wash. And it has some distressing and little holes. Then I got the same shorts in white. These I wore to a football game already and they were so comfy, they're so cute. And again, they're just the perfect little basic short. Then I also got them in black. These are super cute too. I'm obsessed with the black ones as well. I need to make a pair of black bit denim shorts. You guys don't understand that I literally didn't have any denim shorts I liked until I bought these. So now I'm like stocked up for outfits. And then lastly, I just rebought the same pair that I'm wearing right now, just in case they happen to sell out and I like rip them or destroy them. But as you can tell, these look so much fresher on. They're like much less ripped because they haven't been destroyed by being washed so many times. But again, they're still super cute. Going in for a little coffee break right now because I'm sweating. Next, from Free People, I got the same shirt in two colors. First up, I got it in white. This was the original color I bought it in. I had it in my Pinterest boards for months and it was sold out. And then randomly one day, it came back in stock. And when I tell you, I've never ran so fast to buy something. It goes so great with little tennis skirts or little athletic shorts or leggings because I liked it so much. I wanted it in black so badly. And another day I went to look on the website and I kid you not, there was only one left in stock in my size. All the other sizes were sold out. So I ran to buy it. Then I got the same shirt in black. 
but honestly instead of being black it's more of like a dark gray which i really really like actually the next thing i bought is kind of random i'm not even gonna lie but my friend ellie and i went to the mall a couple weeks ago and we we're just like roaming around different stores and i'm pretty sure we went to kohl's and we happened to be like in the clearance section we found these t-shirts and we're like oh these are super cute like these would be really cute high key and the funny thing is it's like a 2x but it literally just fits the exact same as other shirt i just showed you from free people a little bit cropped super flowy and it's just a really pretty blue color speaking of random finds actually i went to sam's the other day with my family and i was just like looking around in their like clothing section which usually is like okay but their graphic tees were low-key popping off like why was sam's graphic tees eating i got it in a large so it'd be nice and oversized it's this really cute little graphic tee it says def leopard rock of ages it has like a little jack what is that it's a jaguar am i dumb i think it's a jaguar i fell in love with the colors though and i thought the colors were super cute i figured it'd be super easy to just throw on with little athletic shorts and call it a fit the next brand i ordered from was every jewels i don't know if you're familiar with the brand it's basically this jewelry brand that has super cute jewelry and it's super affordable but i was looking at the website and i found this like t-shirt deal where they had two mystery baby tees for like nine dollars that's such a steal so of course i like placed an order because i was like i love baby tees it was completely a mystery, so I just put in my size and they randomly gave them to me. The first thing they sent was this plain little navy baby tee. It's super stretchy and super soft, and it's super flattering fit. It is just the perfect little baby tee. I was honestly so surprised by how much I really like this. And then they sent the same tee over, just in white. And again, I was like kind of disappointed it was white, but then when I put it on, I was like, wait, I low-key really love this shirt, and I really love the fit of it. So I'm honestly, again, really glad I got it. Okay, now we're gonna take a little break from clothing and move on to shoes. I wear my white Converse literally every single day. Like my white platform Converse, they go everywhere. Last year when I went to buy my Converse, I wanted pink Converse so bad, but I was like, no, I'm just gonna buy white because they're a good basic to have. But this year I finally splurged and got my dream Converse. I finally got keep converse look how cute these are i'm so freaking obsessed i'm gonna explain to you like how much i love these i wear so much pink on a regular basis so i figured these are perfect to match with all my stuff i'm so happy i have these then i got another pair of shoes i had originally wanted to get the pink ones but when i was searching for platform converse these came up and it was just too good of a deal and i fell in love with the color these were on sale for literally 30 dollars. i love these so much look at this color this color is so pretty, it's so vibrant. It's this peachy orange, and it's like a little bit highlighter, but like a little bit peachy. I'm so happy I got these, and I cannot wait to start styling them. I never owned like an orange shoe, so these are really cool to have. The next place I went was TJ Maxx. I got this at the mall when I went a couple weeks ago. My TJ Maxx is usually never good. For whatever reason, when I went, my TJ Maxx was eating. Like, the first thing I got was this little long sleeve. It's this like orange waffle material. And it's from Aerie actually. My vision for this was to wear this with my orange Converse and like some black leggings. You cannot tell me that would be not be like the cutest thing ever. Then the next thing I got from TJ Maxx, this isn't really a school item, but I thought I'd still include it because I just am obsessed with it. I got this dress. Oh, when I tell you I fell in love with this dress when I saw it, I'm obsessed with the pattern of it. It's so me. Like if you know me, I love fun patterns like this it's just so pretty i swear tj maxx was just trying to like bless me with things that would match my shoes tell me why i literally found this american eagle shirt that's the exact same color as my converse you're joking like hello this with like some denim shorts and my converse or like my leggings and my converse again i found more american eagle i debated on whether or not i wanted to get it but then i just realized like it's so cheap and i just think it'd be perfect to wear with denim shorts it's just like a little something to throw on and it's super light and flowy and soft. It's this little like shirt. You can wear it off the shoulder or on the shoulder. I'll probably wear it on the shoulder for school because of dress code. Then lastly from TJ Maxx, I got this shirt and it's also airy. It's just this little neon tank top. I feel like it's super cute. I don't really have anything neon like this. I feel like this color would be perfect for a spirit day or a football game just, and super flattering. Then next, I placed an order from Natural Life. This is a little small business on like Instagram that I found. And they saw the cutest little bandeau tops. I picked up a couple because I was obsessed. First one I got is a super pretty little floral pattern and it's adorable. It's so soft, so stretchy, so comfy. And then I got the same one again, just in a different pattern. And this is like a rainbow pattern. It's rainbow floral. It's like striped kind of, and it's super cute. Again, it should be super cute to wear under like a jacket or that little Amazon dress. Next up is Curtsy. If you're not familiar with what Curtsy is, it's like this thrifting app where you can like buy clothes secondhand. I actually sold a bunch of my own clothes on Curtsy, so I had a bunch of credits to buy things with. So I placed a couple of little orders and here's everything I got. The first thing I bought was this Free People shirt. This shirt has been going absolutely viral. It's this like tank top made of this like floral stretchy pattern material. 
and this color is just gorgeous then next i got this lululemon swiftly it's this long sleeve swiftly in this really pretty like teal color i'm not really sure what the exact color is it might be mint i think so next thing i got from curtsy was this big oversized t-shirt really pretty yellow color and it's actually urban outfitters i'm obsessed with how big it is it's super oversized it's, it's just the classic urban outfitters oversized t-shirt okay then lastly from curtsy really pretty pink distressed denim shorts a lot of the denim shorts i was finding were like the solid wash i didn't want solid i want the distressed but I just really love them. I think they're a great pair of statement denim to have. Next up, we have Airy. I'm an absolute sucker for Airy. It's probably a favorite store ever. Their stuff is so good. It's such good quality. First up, I got these short. They're such a pretty emerald green color and they're perfect. They have an adjustable waist, which is great because they're actually a little bit too big for me. They actually have built-in spandex underneath them, which is really nice because it means that even if they like ride up that I'm not going to be like flashing anything, if that makes sense. Then, <gasps> y'all, I'm so excited for this. I got this flannel shirt gray like waffle flannel and it has this little button up neck on it i just love how flowy it is and how comfy it's gonna be i cannot wait to wear this in fall this is giving me the fall vibes i need this is giving me back to school then i got this little high neck like tank top and it's like red it's this gorgeous light blue color and i'm really excited to wear it i think it'd be really cute to wear either when i'm running at practice or with a pair of shorts next up i got the same pair of shorts in two colors i'm obsessed with these flowy shorts Mary. But these have the built-in spandex underneath so they're not like uncomfortable at all it's a really pretty pattern i love it so much like paisley pattern almost then i got the same short but instead of being crossover they have like this little cinch in the middle and they have this like tiger print on it and then they say offline like offline airy which i really like i feel like they'd be great to run in or to just wear like a cute little basic shirt next i got a package from hollister i'm obsessed with hollister's like dad jeans or whatever you call them i love pair of like jeans that fit me well and are actually flattering on little rips in the knees and i actually rolled them up on the ends because they're a little bit too long for me since i'm short and i didn't realize that i should buy the short jeans instead of the regular length then i got a bunch of baby tees <laughs> now looking back at this they're all the same color but it's fine the first baby tee i got and it says the electric days experience i just thought the graphic was cute i don't really know these baby tees are like five or six dollars a piece and they're like the softest things ever and then i got the same one in this tiger print it has a little tiger on the front and again super cute super stretchy super soft then i don't know why i bought them all in the same color i guess i was really in a mood for the color cream i guess when i bought them this might be my favorite one of them all and it has this like little tropical scene on it i love the beach and i want to go to hawaii so badly so I thought this is just perfect. Then lastly, I got this one. I take it back when I said this might be my favorite one actually. It reminds me of something you buy from like a little like touristy shop in Costa Rica. So I really like this graphic. Then onto the last package of the entire haul. I placed the Shein order. With Shein, you have to be careful what you're buying. You have to really look at the reviews in order to get good stuff. But I feel like a bunch of the stuff I got from here was really good items. So I'm gonna show you what I got. Shein has a bunch of like little sub brands under their big brand of Shein. And one brand of theirs I really like is the Glow Mode line brand, whatever. I don't know. Their stuff is a little bit more pricey for Shein, but it's still cheap. But it's such good quality. First up, I got this pair of athletic shorts. These are actually literally like the exact same thing as the area shorts I showed you earlier. They're just the crossover like shorts that have the flare out at the end. But the reason why I bought them from Shein was because they were sold out on Aerie in my size. They're so comfy, so soft, and they feel exactly like my Aerie ones. And the second thing I got from Glow Mode was this tank top. It's like the exact same thing as the line tank. They're super great, super flattering, and I just am obsessed with this color. It's literally the exact same materials as Lulu's. Then next up from Natural Shein brand, I got the same shirt in two colors. <laughs> it's just this little v-neck t-shirt. It's oversized, kind of heathered, I don't know if you can tell, but I got it in this really pretty pink color. I also got it in this really pretty blue color. I got these t-shirts because I feel like they'd be super easy to just throw on with like athletic shorts and like a little like bralette underneath. My vision was to actually wear these off the shoulder. And like Next up, I got this little baby shirt it looks like a corset but it's actually not it just feels like a normal baby tee i actually wore it to the first football game of this season but it's super cute on i love it it's super flattering and i got this black t-shirt let me put you on this t-shirt if you don't want to spend 40 dollars on the free people one this shirt is like an exact dupe for the free people one i showed you earlier it comes really oversized i was looking in my closet before back to school and i was like what do i need to buy and i realized one of the basics i'm missing are like sweatshorts i don't really have any good sweatshorts so i got this pink pair they're super cute i got them in a medium instead of a small so like they'd be really long and like baggy and oversized they don't have pockets which makes me sad but like it's honestly whatever and then i bought the same ones in gray because again good basic to have it didn't have a gray pair i feel like this would also be really cute paired with the gray waffle shirt i got from airy it's like a little set moment so i don't know next i got this really cute little shirt i don't really know how to explain what this material is but it's like a knit type beat so i wear like a little tank top underneath it but i feel like it's really cute with a pair of denim shorts 
but it's got a cute little outfit. Next up, I got this little shirt. It's this little like athletic tank top. It's super stretchy and red. It's literally the exact same thing as the Up to Street tank from Lulu, except for it's a fraction of the price, obviously. Then next, I got this shirt. Look how cute it is. It's like flowy, and it almost again reminds me of the Free People one I got. But it's this little striped one that's super soft and stretchy. The next up, I got a couple of graphic tees because their graphic tees are actually really cute. First up, I got this one. I just thought it was really cute and I like the color of it. And I think it matched my Converse really well. So this might be my favorite one I got, honestly. It's this little gray one that says California on it. But I don't know how to explain it, but the words are like fluffy. Wait, no, not fluffy. Um, What do you call it? But it's super cute and I just think it's perfect. And I got this graphic tee. I don't know. I just liked it a lot. It's a lot longer than the other ones I bought, which is nice. So I can like tuck it in if I want to be shorter or I can wear it full length with like leggings or something. But it reminded me of Brandy Mello, which is why I bought it. Last but not least, I got this little shirt. It's a little like peplum blouse moment. I just think it's really cute. It's waffle material kind of again. And again, like I said, waffle material reminds me of back to school. So obviously I picked her up. I think it's super, super cute. So that was one long haul. Let me know what your favorite store I purchased from was. And then let me know what your favorite item overall was. And stay tuned for more back to school content. I'm filming a high school week in my life vlog soon. So you guys love those videos. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe, and stay tuned for next week's video. Bye, guys.